Hello guys, uh, welcome to uh, one more uh, uh, tutorial of uh, uh, Year Entertainments. Today I'll be showing uh, how to check uh, VSS writers on Windows Server. It can be 2003, 2008 or 2012. The first thing is you have to log on to your Windows machine and then go to click on start and go to command prompt. Okay, it will bring up your um, command prompt. So now you have to type VSS admin list writers. Okay, so it will bring up all the volume shadow copy service writers that are available on your particular server. Just maximize this, scroll up a little bit. So we have to ensure that all the writers are in stable state with no error status. See task scheduler, it's stable and no error. VSS metadata store writer, stable, no error. Performance counters, stable, no error. System writer, stable, no error. SQL writer, stable, no error. ASR writer, it is also stable. Registry writer, stable. Compless writer, stable. Shadow copy optimization writer, stable. VMI writer, stable. In the similar way, if this is an exchange server, you will find additionally something called as an exchange VSS writer. Just like what we have a SQL writer here, here, right? In this case, similarly you have exchange writer. It should be stable and no error. And also for SharePoint server, you will have additional writer, something called as SharePoint writer. SharePoint, uh, is, uh, yes, so that should be stable and error, stable and no error. If in case, if in case uh, there is any uh, related error under the uh, last uh, error here, it says uh, like a re retriable error or not stable. The only solution for that is you have to reboot the you have to reboot the machine then only it will refresh the windows writers so even if you restart the vss service that will not give you um, that will not give you enough results because uh, microsoft recommendation is to just reboot the server directly so the only thing what you have to do is uh, just uh, explain the situation to the customer or your client say that hey we have to reboot the server because uh, the vss writers these are kernel level writers and that that uh, requires a reboot of the server completely to refresh them so that is only how you will troubleshoot and there is no other troubleshooting way these i mean is just uh, even if you restart i'll show you the service where is it, uh, it is, yeah volume volume machado copy service even if you restart this uh, it will not make any difference so we can see the dependencies, it's RPC dependency, that's it. And the other thing is, uh, I want to show you, um, I want to show you one more thing. Uh, so uh, there are very uh, common VSS uh, uh, error messages. Let's go back to the Google and search for what are the common VSS error messages. Just type common VSS writer errors, you'll get a bunch of uh, KB articles, okay, from various vendors. Okay, let's see. Um, okay, VSS timeout error. Let's see what it says. This is one of the semantic uh, backup exec. They will say, um, see, uh, this guy is getting. Um, a continual VSS writers timeout issues on one of our machine. We are backing up server 2008 R2 SP1 using semantic backup exec. So what this guy, he already checked uh, VSS uh, admin risk writers. So it seems, see, the system writer is getting timed out here. That is the error message it's showing. So for this, let's see what um, they gave. What I can see is that you have to increase. There is an option called uh, the registry key where you can go and increase the, the VSS uh, timed out. 
So uh, the troubleshooting uh, here, what they have gave is to re-register all the uh, VSS uh, writer-related DLLs. See, if the first thing you have to do is, if you're getting any VSS right, try rebooting the server. Check the MS documentation to fix the VSS errors. Okay. And if still it's, we have same issues, then uh, try uh, re-registering the DLL files. So because we need to understand why, because there is a dependency. Okay, whenever uh, so most of the times uh, there is no need for you to re-register the DLLs. It's just if you reboot the server, that should be fine. And let's go and check one other, uh, one more um, uh, known uh, troubleshooting. Okay. Um, so let's see what we have in this VSS troubleshooting here in this. Okay. So this is one of the article for VSS troubleshooting guide. Okay. And it says, uh, see the same thing, reboot your agent server and check the command prompt VSS list writers. And uh, yeah, this is the same uh, troubleshooting, uh, the standard troubleshooting step you have to perform, guys, for uh, VSS writers. So let's go back to the uh, the VM machine. So this is, we are back here. So guys, this is how you will troubleshoot about the VSS writers. So um, stay tuned for more tutorials like this and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching and have a nice day.